This is Brandon Payne with Accelerate Basketball, Stephen Curry's personal skills and performance coach. Today we're going to take a look at some of the drills we do in Steph's workouts that, that deal with ball handling. These are things that are easy to replicate at home, but things that have a really big impact on how we work on a day-to-day -day basis with Stefan. These are things just simple with tennis balls, two balls with a partner. You can do them at home, you can do them as a part of your shooting workout, or you can do them as a part of your warm-up getting ready to shoot. Let's take a look at them. The first drill here is going to be something, it's, it's the base tennis ball drill series that we go through, which is something where he's just tossing or bouncing the tennis ball with himself, not using a wall and not using a partner. So on this one, we're going to follow the same principles that we talked about with our balance series last week. We want to make sure he's got a tight core. We want to make sure he's breathing and he's keeping the basketball at the same speed the entire time. We don't want the basketball to slow down or speed up based on the speed of the tennis ball. So as long as he's keeping the basketball consistent, he's doing these things correctly. Then we're going to progress. We're going to go off the wall. So this is just a simple between the legs where he's tossing the ball off the wall, catching it with the opposite hand. Again, same principles. We're trying to breathe, tight core, making sure the ball is moving, moving uh, quickly and smoothly. Then we progress further. So we're going to go now. So each hand has its own assignment. One hand is crossing over. One hand is going between the legs. So we're going to progressively get more difficult as we go through these drills as we get closer to time to shoot. So this one again, he's got a crossover and a between the legs and you can put any two, any two moves together to create any combination you want, but it just be simple in terms of, you know, catching, tossing, catching, tossing and breathing. Don't get too complicated as you're getting it started with these drills. Then we're gonna progress further. So we go from here to what we call double moves. So the next drill you're gonna see is where he's gonna to toss the ball off the wall and he's actually gonna go behind his back twice and catch it. So it's a double behind the back and then he catches it. So this is a big step up from the individual moves that we just watched. So this is something that's gonna take some time to work up to, things that are gonna take you a lot of reps. Uh, just make sure you have a, a few tennis balls around because as these things get, get away from you, you don't wanna get caught in, in the middle of your workout chasing uh, tennis balls down. Then we'll go to partner two ball drills. Again, so we're gonna stay pretty simple here, just with the between the legs, but he's got a partner here flashing numbers at him, forcing him to keep his eyes up, forcing him to make a decision on what the number he's seeing is, which is gonna replicate things that he sees in games. So again, these are drills you can go through at home, just if you've got a, a, a parent or a sibling around, you can replicate the same things that we do with Stefan's workouts in the off season with your workouts at home as you're preparing to get back to your team 